Welcome to Reliance Training on Elements of the Reliance User Interface. In this video, we'll cover the main elements on the screen in Reliance that are used between all of the modules. At the top of the screen is the header. It includes the Reliance logo as well as your profile information. We'll quickly walk through the header functions from left to right. By clicking on the Reliance logo, you can directly link to our corporate website. The sidebar expand and collapse icon allows you to collapse and expand the sidebar to have more space for your analysis. The help menu includes various help related functions such as accessing the online help guide, learning more about the particular module that you have selected on our corporate website, and links to contact us as well as provide feedback. The account menu includes functions such as editing your profile, changing your email address and password, and signing out. Next, the leftmost portion of the screen is the sidebar. It is your central area for actions related to your analyses. The exact functions in the sidebar will vary depending on the Reliance modules you have purchased and selected, but general functions include current dashboard and analysis selectors for what data you want to view, a module selector for the Reliance module you want to view within the analysis you have selected, and a functions section that contains analysis related functions. In this case, we're viewing reliability prediction, so our functions include calculating and viewing results, reporting, importing and exporting via Excel files, and setting analysis properties and settings. To the right of the sidebar is the main window, which contains data pertaining to the Reliance module that is active. The left portion of the main window is the Analysis Tree and Block Diagram Viewer. This contains the system hierarchy that you define for your analysis. Here, we are looking at our quadcopter drone example analysis, which includes multiple levels such as a motherboard, GPS, and ground controller. The right portion of the main window is the data viewer. Here, you will see data pertaining to the particular Reliance module and analysis tree or block diagram component you have selected. In this case, we are looking at the parts table in reliability prediction for the quadcopter drone component. Here, we can see all of the parts we have defined in our quadcopter drone component. Each data view in Reliance has a toolbar at the top with varying buttons depending on the Reliance module selected. Some common functions include Save and Cancel if you have changed data in your analysis, Insert and Delete to add and remove data from your analysis, Cut, Copy and Paste to cut, copy and paste one or multiple records in your analysis, Filter, which will allow you to sort ascending and sort descending, in addition to the filter button, you can also filter any of the columns in the table. This can be done by clicking the arrow icon at the top of any column, which will allow you to sort that individual column in ascending or descending order, and also search for and filter out specific values. Last up in the toolbar is the refresh button, which will refresh the data in the table. This is useful if you have multiple users in Reliance editing the same data at the same time. Also, many of the table views in Reliance, similar to the parts table that we see here, have an additional form view. While the table view is a great way for viewing multiple records, the form view is an excellent way to view detailed information on a single record. You can access the form view by selecting the To Form button on the far right of the toolbar. Here, we are directed to the parts form in reliability prediction where we can see detailed information on a single part that was selected in the table. To return back to the table view, simply click the To Table button on the far right of the toolbar. Thanks for watching. Please visit our website or contact us with any questions and to obtain pricing and purchasing information.